Rana Faruhar is joining us now here at the University of Denver. She is Time's assistant managing editor. And Rana, I wonder what you thought of the two candidates as they talked about the economy. How did their two plans measure up against each other? Well, I think that the key issue is really taxes. And I think that you have to wonder whether Romney's math adds up. I think that we're still left uh, really wondering about a lot of details about how this plan is going to uh, going to garner the revenue that he's talking about. I think that we still don't know what sort of loopholes are going to be closed and whether or not the math can be made to work without opening up very politically contentious loopholes like the mortgage interest deduction. But I think that there is a bigger math issue here, and that's whether or not lowering tax rates actually creates jobs and growth. And I would argue that factually it doesn't. It hasn't over the last three years, and it hasn't, it didn't in 2000 when the Bush tax era tax cuts were much deeper and broader. And I think that that's really the problem here. 